Today's moral story is being a good neighbor. It is a dark and rainy. The doorbell rings. It is your friend who lives next door. He is worried because his parents have not come home from work. You say, "Don't worry, uncle and auntie will be home soon. Till then, you can stay here and play with me." Your mother is also very caring. She brings hot soup and snacks for both of you. We should always try to help our neighbors when they are in trouble. But what about those who need our help but do not live next door? Can we think of them as neighbors too? Yes, we can. As uh, this story teaches us, Rinchen's neighbor. One winter, it snowed heavily in Ladakh. This blankets of snow covered everything. Not a single person could be seen outside. Then, just as Rinchen and her family sat down for dinner, there was a knock on the door. A tired traveler had come looking for shelter. The family welcomed him. Please join us. Dinner is almost ready. As he ate, the traveler said, "How lucky you are!" At the last house where I stopped for help, there was no food at all. The axe had destroyed everything in the field, and the family had very little food for the winter. Even the children went to bed hungry. Rinchen's mother heard this in silence. That night, Rinchen and her mother worked hard to pack a big basket with dry fruits and vegetables, corns and barley, yak butter and cheese flour. Rinchen's mother asked the traveler where the other house was. You can't walk there. It is several kilometers in the snow. That is all right," said Rinchen's. father how can we eat in peace when a neighbor goes hungry neighbor the traveler was surprised they live so far away that it will take you a day to reach them it is not matter how far away they live that still our neighbors rinchen's mother said whenever we are at a mall a park or at school we must think of people around us our neighbors and look at how to, to see how we can help them we can hold the lift doors open for them help carry their bags inside the house read to smaller children offer to water plants see if there is anything they need when you go to the shop do you know your neighbors what are their names Be careful be safe some bigger or older boys and girls are friendly and nice they will play with you tell you jokes and look after you others will not be nice to you some older or bigger girls and boys may snatch your lunch box away some may stop you in the corridor and not let you pass until you give them something they may even force you to say or do things that you do not want to do when someone behave this way it is called bullying punching or hitting someone making others bully someone calling someone names ignoring someone in a group so they feel bad making fun of someone in front of others making someone cry leaving someone out of a game or a group so they feel bad telling someone if you don't do this i will or some waste people bully each other so be always careful thank you for all my channel subscribers and viewers thank you for all your great support thank you